welcome to the TARDIS, everyone. Now, this is the new set for the 12th Doctor. It's pretty exciting. But I know some kids who are even more excited than me. They're about to come in here on a special studio tour. But what they don't know is they're also going to be meeting a special someone. Watch this space. This is My favourite bit is probably all the detail up the top, so like all the bookcases, there's just lots of detail. My favourite bit is the console because there's so many buttons. I'm so surprised because it definitely is bigger on the inside. Time for a quick photo in the TARDIS, but we're about to get caught in the act. What are you doing on my TARDIS? <gasps> Children only come here by invite. I hope you've all been invited. Hello, I'm Peter Capaldi, who plays the new Doctor Who. Do you have some questions for me? I understand. We do, don't we? Are you all, you're all a bit shocked, aren't you? <laughs> it is shocking. I am shocking. Why did you want to become the Doctor? Um, because it's the, the, the greatest role in television. And also, it's probably the closest you could get to, to actually travelling through to space and time. So. Who, who wouldn't want to do that? Were you worried from taking over from Matt Smith? Was I worried about taking over from Matt Smith? Yes, because he's fantastic. I love Matt Smith. I think he's the most amazing doctor. He's so funny and so clever. He's so wise. He's so young. He's so old. He's a brilliant actor and he's a lovely guy. He's ticked all the boxes there, so it is quite a difficult job to take over when someone so wonderful has been doing it. But. Um, he, I think, is on my side, so uh, I hope everyone else will be too. Have you had any embarrassing moments on set yet? Well, this can sometimes be a little bit embarrassing. I know uh, Jenna, my um, companion, sometimes has a little bit of embarrassment with this because she loves this particular panel so much and she was playing with it one day and did this. <sighs> Broke it. <laughs> if she ever leaves the TARDIS, we're going to give her this. If you had to choose between the sonic screwdriver and the TARDIS, which would you choose? TARDIS. What would you choose? The TARDIS. Yeah. <laughs> That's the right choice, I think. We can always make another sonic screwdriver, as long as we've got the TARDIS. But the sonic screwdriver can't take us through time and space. You know, the TARDIS has always been with the Doctor. The TARDIS is a part of the Doctor. And he loves it dearly. Do you think there will ever be a female Doctor? I think quite possibly, yeah. I think that's, uh, yeah, why, why shouldn't it be? If you could completely um, convert your um, dying body into a brand new one, or into a slightly older one in my case, you could easily do it into uh, a female one. And I think a female doctor would be fun. Well, thank you all very much for your questions. And now I've got a question for you. Do you happen to know how to fly this thing? Oh! But don't touch that button, whoa! Fly, 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 yeah! For more Newsround videos like this, have a look at the Newsround website.